this is a routine uh, soft cataract about grade 1 to 2 nucleosclerosis where I will be demonstrating the divide and conquer technique. I have done my incisions, put in some um, HPMC and I go ahead uh, after putting some HPMC over the cornea I go ahead and perform the capsular excess with my uh, bent 26 gauge needle. So initiating the rexus and then lifting up a flap and slowly guiding it around to make a 5.5 mm rexus. Now since this cataract is very soft, it's not a very good idea to chop it because you're not going to get a very good hold on it and hence I have decided to uh, do a divide and conquer mainly for demonstration. Just a little bit of a stutter there, but uh, continue with my rexus. And the soft cat tracks, because you don't have uh, any support, sometimes the rexus can be a bit difficult. So, there I have done my hydro dissection, decompress, pressurize the chamber. And decide I need to do another wave just to make sure. Again, pressurize and come out. I then fill the chamber with HPMC and I take a blunt chopper in my left hand and I have taken my 2.2 FACO tip in my right. Just aspirate some of the superficial cortex. And I'm in my sculpting parameters. That is, it's uh, about 100 mm uh, vacuum, 18 to 20 mL flow rate, and uh, this must be around 50 ultrasound. But of course, I'm not using that much. So just making the initial trench, even the 100 mm vacuum seems to be grabbing the nucleus. Make sure I make a deep enough trench, rotate it, deep on the other side as well. And now I am making the cruciate sculpting. I make one side and you can see I can still deepen it down there. Rotate it and do the other side as well. Since this is an educational video, I am going a bit slow. Just making sure I have got deep enough trenches to crack the nucleus and there is the first crack. I will rotate it around 180 degrees. The second crack so that I get two heminuclei and then the third and finally rotate it and get the fourth as well. And once that's done, it's time to take out the segments. This point, I am at 400 millimeters vacuum, 40 ml AFR, and uh, the same uh, FACO power, about 50. That is a preset value. And I am in the pulse mode. I am at around 40 hertz per. And I am taking out these segments it's coming out well once all of them are removed I then switch to my bi-manual and remove all the cortex 
of course my parameters are much lower it's around 300 millimeters of vacuum and around 20 to 25 ml flow rate and you have to occlude the tip and strip the cortex off towards the center don't take it out in bits and pieces it's better if you take it out in sheets there's a bit of a, a PC opacity as well so I'm just clearing that up with my polishing uh, parameters and that's way lower than the aspiration parameters around 5 mm of uh, mercury and 5 mL flow rate linearly controlled I then inject my uh, single piece hydrophilic iol directly into the bag under HPMC sorry this is a hydrophobic lens single piece hydrophobic lens these are the final touches where I am aspirating off the HPMC from within the chamber I conclude the surgery by an intracameral antibiotic and hydrating the wounds. Thank you so much for watching.